biggest difference on what you're seeing from this team on the pitch since Ladero has joined this team? I think um, <clears throat> he's provided a spark for sure. Um, he brings something that not a lot of players have. Um, creativity, uh, he sees passes that not a lot of players see. Um, you know, you're starting to see more and more players like that in the league, but when, when he is on the field, he pushes the guys around him uh, to be better as well. And that's all that you can ask from a, a player of his caliber. Um, I think he's taken a lot on his shoulders. He knows, he knows the situation that we're in, the history of the club, um, and he's taken it in stride, um, you know, coming in. I still don't think he's got his, his travel out from under his legs yet. And I think we're still yet to see the best of him, um, and that will come in the next in, in the coming weeks. So uh, excited to see what the, what the next uh, few weeks has for us as we push on. So much to talk about the great effort on this team. How have you seen the effort change in these last three weeks to say a month or two months ago? You know, I, to be honest, I thought that the effort was there. We were creating chances before, and it was a matter of finishing chances. If, if you go back, um, you know, one, two months ago. We're, we're getting opportunities. It's just a matter of banging them away. Um, and, and little things can change the course of a, of a season. Um, this is a, a good enough league to that if you do not finish your one chance, you're probably not going to get any points. And that to me is uh, indicative of a, of a good league and, and that other teams will make you punish no matter where they are in the standings. And that's happened to us. So uh, credit to the guys uh, banging away a few chances and uh, it gives everybody confidence. It takes some pressure off the defense. Um, and, uh, you know, we're at home. So number one, we, we want to get, get a win. How important has it been for the defense to stay intact through all of this, to communication and staying together as teams try to move you around? Yeah, of course, I think communication is key. I think we are playing a little bit smarter uh, in terms of when we send our outside backs forward, making sure that the other one is is uh, is staying connected with Chad or I, whether that's Joven or um, or Tyrone on the other side, and, and also making sure that one of Christian or Ozzy is in front of us at all times, so that we've gotten caught on a number of counterattacks. If you look at the early part of the year, and, and we're getting stung a little bit. Um, so, in, in saying that, playing a little bit more conservative, but not even conservative, just more a little bit more smart in knowing that we can still send one forward as long as we keep the other one back, um, and that has paid dividends um, in you know goals against. Is it fair to say the the defensive play of the two midfielders you just talked about is something? that's underrated right now and that's helped in this resurgence? Uh, of course, I think, well, listen, you bring in one guy, sometimes it can spark. You bring in a new coach, it also ignites a flame under the whole group. So I think everybody is re-energized. Um, new trainings, new process of uh, the, the daily process can sometimes invigorate a group. So just the slightest change can uh, can make a difference, but also, you know, we're winning games, so that doesn't help. That obviously helps. Could have been a two-goal lead, maybe, maybe more. Is winning one goal by one goal, is that good for this group? Yeah, I mean, obviously, if, if you ask around, it should have been, you know, two or three. But at the end of the day, results are going to come different ways. Um, and we've got to find a way to do it in, in certain circumstances. So now the test is, is if we go behind, can we come back and, and win a game? Um, if we get it to a tie, can we then push and, and get a result? So the wins have to come in different ways to to find ourselves in a good position. So, you know, we'll take this one tonight. Um, obviously, see what we did well, see what we didn't do well, and move on to next week.